Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get the APK time alternative app store to your Fire Stick or Android TV device. It will allow you to download thousands of amazing applications to your Fire Stick and the ones which are not available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And there are lots of interesting categories, such as sports, premium services, players and browsers, live TV, gaming, free VPNs, essentials, entertainments, and so on. And the whole setup is super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. First of all, you will have to get an app code and loader. You can actually get it totally for free from the official Amazon App Store. To so, we go to search on your device and start typing the loader in the search bar. And now, as you can see, the downloader has already popped out for us at the bottom. So we click on it and there is the app that you need to get to your device. But after you got the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. So in order to actually set up the loader, we'll have to go to the settings by clicking on that button with the gear icon. Then we scroll down and go to My Fire TV. Let's open it. And from here, we'll have to locate and turn on the developer options on your device. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Stick devices, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, and you cannot find developer options anywhere, no need to worry, it's actually easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you'll have to click on the middle button on your remote for seven times, and do it fast, so let's do it. And as you can see, for me at the bottom it says no need, you are already a developer, and in your case it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which now have appeared for us right here. Open them, make sure to turn on ADP debugging, then go to install known apps. From here, we just locate the loader and turn the option on. So what it does is going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps, which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now, finally, we got to go to the list of apps on your device, which is right here. Let's open it, and there you'll find the loader, which is set up and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I always recommend doing. It's, of course, connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN, because they're super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use and they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server. Let's say I will connect to France right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means no one can track you or snoop on you online, and that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in the pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get three months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you are watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN with three months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now, with the camera of your phone. It works the same way, and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now, finally, let's use the loader safely. So we gotta go to the list of apps on your device. Start up with the loader application. And here, on the left side menu, make sure to click on Home and not on Browser. And then here, in that search bar, we'll need to enter a code, which is going to be two, one, two, five, four. So once again, the code is two, one, two, five, four. Make sure to enter it exactly as you see and do not make any mistakes. Because obviously, if you make a mistake, then the code is not going to work. After that, you have to click on go and while it's loading, make sure to subscribe my channel so you would get even more content about fire sticks. As well as please hit the like button below this video. It really helps me a lot and this way I'll be able to create even more videos for you. And now, after the website has opened for us, all you have to do is click that green download button. And now, in a couple of moments, the download is going to start. Usually it doesn't take long, but of course it all depends on your connection speed. 
then you have to click on install and wait until APK time gets installed to your Fire Stick or Android TV, depending on what kind of device you are using. And then don't click on open yet, instead press on done, because this way you will be able to delete the installation files, as we don't need them anymore on your device. So click on delete and then delete once again. This way we get rid of unnecessary files from our Fire Stick and save yourself some free space on your device. And that's really important, because you don't have too much of free space on your device anyway. Now we'll have to go to the settings once again. You already know how to do that, so we click on the bottom of the gear icon, scroll down, go to My Fire TV, then open Developer Options, go to Install Known Apps. From here, this time, we'll have to locate APK Time and turn that option on as well. It's a must because we'll be using APK Time to download other applications from the internet. And yeah, I'm sorry for my dog who is barking for me right now. Yeah, so now we gotta go to the list of apps on your device, and there at the bottom you'll find APK Time, which we just unloaded. Now I would recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote, that's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it, and then press on Move to Front. This way APK Time is always going to be at the very top of your application list, and therefore it's going to be super easy for you to access the app every time you need it. And now finally we open the application, wait until it loads for you, and there you'll find all kinds of categories, such as top applications, animation, entertainment, essentials, free VPNs, gaming, and so on. So you just open any of those categories and explore all the apps that are available for download. Hope you enjoyed the video and see you next time. Bye-bye.